So I'm going to activate number three right here, this guy. And his command dial is a squadron command, which I'm going to take as a token. And the token with a uh, comms net on number three gets thrown over to the Venator. Nobody's within attack range. So we're just going to go to the movement phase. Everyone's at speed one. So he's just going to move at speed one. Okay, so turn two, I'm going, my very first ship I'm going to activate is this guy. So he's running an engineering token or engineering command. Doesn't really do anything because I can't take the token and he doesn't have uh, comms or anything. And there's nobody to project shields to, so there is nobody to shoot at. Should be good. And then he's gonna move. Let's go ahead and activate the VSD. He has an engine man, and he'll take that as a token. Let's see how far away am I from you? Can I shoot you? No, so. But I can fly. I can't. Do you have a red flag? I don't have a red flag, though. Um. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and spend the squadron token okay. to activate uh, one? Uh, one of these guys here. Interceptors? Uh, Ty advanced. And he is going to come up right on you. Yeah, so he's going to go ahead and come up right here. Okay, so he's activated, so he can uh, move and He's activated, so yes, he will be able to shoot. The only thing he can. That bad boy. Three blues in the wing. We got one hit. Miss, and one hit. One hit on the wing. And now... This bad boy is gonna move. He's gonna land on your kind of bench? Nope, he's not that fast. Oh yeah, he's a little bit speed too. But he does hit an asteroid. <laughs> he hits an asteroid? Oh yeah, he does. Just that's on a, the back end. So that's a critical face up, right? Yep, he's gonna critical face up. Uh, damage crew, when overlap your shield, ship or vehicle, deal one yep. face down damage card to your ship. Okay, I'm gonna activate my flagship, my Venator. And he gets a squadron activation. With my ship, I have a flight commander, so I can resolve my command after I move. So if nobody's within attack range, which I think your your guy is within long range of my side arc, maybe. It's single arc. Yeah, single arc. Single arc from the side, so I get two red dice. So I'm just gonna toss the two red dice at your front. Hey, you might as well take them, right? So hit, I have link turbo lasers on this one. So we're we rolling. Uh, I get an accuracy. Whoa, I didn't want to knock that. Um, so I'm going to lock up your redirect. He's got three on the front, so I'll go ahead and just one bit. redirect one. Put it on this side. There we go. Okay, I'm going to move. He's at speed one, gonna turn slightly. Okay, so now that I moved, I'm then going to activate my squadron. Uh, I'm going to spend my squadron token with Yularen, I get to activate two of them with my squadron. And then the ship itself has uh, five squadrons, so I can activate up to seven squadrons. And I have boosted comms, so anybody within long range. Which is pretty much everybody. Should be. And they're engaged with that guy. So I'm gonna activate Kit Fisto. He's gonna fly over as far as he can from this position. Wait, wait. So he's going out. He's activated and he's firing. Uh, I have flight controllers. The anti-squadron armament of each squadron that you activate is increased by one blue die. With Kit Fisto, it's three blues, one black. Against your Titan. So, uh, one, two, three, four damage. Okay, so he's down to one. Okay, so I'm going to activate another one of these uh, torrent squadrons. He's gonna, he can move up to three, so he's just going to try and push himself up in here. Same thing. These guys get two blues, a red, and then an extra blue. I'm just showing you so you can see what I'm doing. Holy bad roll. You can see him real good. 
just need one damage. Probably the red. Just need one. Okay. Well, <laughs> nothing! I'm going to activate another one of these dum dums. So, same thing. Hopefully, this guy can do at least one damage. I mean, not that much damage. We okay, did three damage. All right, you killed him. Okay, I've activated three out of seven, so I can activate another four. So I'm gonna activate, activating this guy. And I think he's still within range one of your side arc. Yes, I, I got line of sight on your side. So I'm gonna bomb you. I'm going to roll one black dice. Uh, it's a hit, so. Round to one. Okay. This guy was a bit closer, so I should be able to jump him like right in front of my other guy. Okay, same thing, he's gonna be attacking your side. Uh, I have Bomber Command with number two, and he's within range, so I'm gonna do a reroll. That Bomber can't hit crap, okay. I'm gonna try and drop right in here without knocking everybody over. Okay, that was still within three, and I think I can still hit your side. Okay. Okay, damage. I will go ahead and spend your uh, Put it on the front. I'm going to activate my last bomber that I can with this, with my activation. And he's just going to jump right in front of this guy. Okay, same thing. Okay, damage. Okay, so I've activated all seven of my squadrons. He's moved and fired, so it's your turn. I will go ahead and activate the ISD. I'm as an engineering. I'm going to token it. Let's go ahead and do some flacking. Flacking out the front. Unless I can hit your... There are a lot of candidates. There are a lot of candidates. That's... I am just out of range. I am just out of... Yeah. That's... Okay. Let's take a look. So, he has two black dice for him. So, he will be... So, black dice means you can only hit within close range. So, all four of those guys there. Definitely, yeah. This one right here, sitting next to the VSD. Two hits. Two hits. Two hits. Okay. And then the one right behind him. Two hits again. What? I've never been that lucky. They're black uh, you're lucky he's throwing crits with those as well. I know, I was throwing <laughs> black dice. Yeah, so you were rolling crap, yes. <laughs> well no, I've like the last time I did anti-squadron stuff, I couldn't get any hits. I even had uh, ordnance experts who could re-roll those, and I was still not getting it. Let's do this guy up front here. Two more black guys. Thank you. All right. And the last guy right there. Good job. One hit. Yeah. All right. And let's go ahead and have some. I will use Drums Navigate command on this to turn him into Rolo. He'll stay at speed 3. We're going to have some fun here in a second. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Rebecca taught me this. I'm going to use it to get that extra tick built. I'm going to have to You're get landing these guys out of the way real quick. We're going to be flying through them. Through them or on them? Through them. So let's just get them out of the way real quick and then go ahead and use the ISD. What speed is he going at? Speed 3. That is one crazy looking maneuver. Those things can definitely go fast. <laughs> he didn't, oh. So I have avoided all your squadrons. <laughs> mm, we're playing superior positions. True, true. Okay, so where are those four all go? Right there. Just yeah, they, right they, next they to were. Him. So they didn't get bumped? No, he didn't, I guess. No. I just had to move him out of the way so he could stick his Yeah, okay. Okay, so I've already activated my Venator, I've already activated uh, one of the Peltas, I'm going to activate my other Pelta. It has an Engineering Command, it's going to take that as a token on itself, and then it's going, it's at speed one, so it is going to drive at speed one. Okay, all my sides activated, so you go. Right. Last one to go is the Gladiator. He has a Concentrate Fire, which you will take as a token. Alright. And he's not in range of anybody. So let's go ahead and do some movement. 
him. And you'll use drones to give him an extra tick. Mm -hmm. I want to do this. Yeah, I want to do this. Looks like he's just a little bit outside. But maybe he's gonna come at sex effect. I think it's at long range, so he can oh, hit me. He is. So he can hit yeah. me with his front arc with two red dice. Does he have that red dice? He does have two yes, red yes, dice. Yes, on the yes front. he has the decimator. Yeah, the demolisher. Demolisher. So, two red dice on the front, hitting the front of your pistol. Okay. Two hits and a crit. Okay, wow. two hits and a crit on uh, number three. Number three. Number three. So we are going to evade. So we're going to get rid of your double hit. Okay. And then I'm going to just take the one damage to the front. So that's all three of your ships and that squadrons. Okay, so I'm just going to jump up to... He's activated, that was his movement. I'm going to attack the front of your Imperial Star Destroyer. With those two? Uh, with, I'm going to start with this guy. Okay. Whoa, I guess. Moved him, activated him. So he's bombing the front of your ISD with a hit crit. We use bomber, so that also yeah. activates. I'll go ahead and redirect. Yep. Yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and catch it. Let's go ahead and activate Sinterfell. He's activated. He's coming over here. He can move five. He can move five. Now I will activate the other TIE Interceptor, and then he's going to come over here too. I am barely within attack range. Okay. So, hit. I'll take that on the front. Alright. Alright, now I will go ahead and activate the, this bad boy, the other TIE Advanced. Mm -hmm. And he can move four, so he's going to come right here next to you guys. So we just did the command phase, so at the start of the ship phase, I'll go ahead and activate Thrawn, who will give everybody an engineer command. I will go ahead, also at the start of the ship phase, I'm going to spend this command token on the ISD for the uh, shields to maximum. Okay, so I'm activating my Venator as the ship that's going first. He's got a squadron command. He's going to spend his squadron token do that. I'm going to fire, I think I got your, your victory double arc this time. Would you like a laser? Uh, I think I got your front arc twice, right? Uh, the front arc, your front arc can go to my side. And my side arc's got your front arc. Okay. So you are double arc, it's just kind of interesting. Okay, so I'm gonna use my front to fire on your side with two red dice. Two red. So two hits to your side right here. So I will go ahead and use a redirect. Stick it on this side. And a one. Okay. Now I'm going to fire from my side arc to your front with the same thing, two red dice. Uh, link turbo laser. Wow. So he's going to move first and then activate his squadrons. So he moves. I spent a token so you can activate up to seven again within long range. So I think that's everybody. So we are going to have to try and get rid of these interceptors. But because I have escort on the tire advanced, they're escort he's escorting the So I have to kill him. Yes. The, unless you're outside of one of the Okay, I'm activating Kit Fisto. He's flying out on this side. And he's activated by the Venator, so he gets an extra dice. So he's going to roll three blues, a black, and then the extra blue for being activated. So three hits and I'm walking up your scatter. Okay, I'll go ahead and brace that. Uh, two damage. Alright, so now I gotta counter you. Two. Okay, yeah. Uh, hit and I'm going to activate one of my V19 Torrent Squadrons. Yeah, you'll, you'll want to tuck him up right next to the. Uh... There you go. Okay. I think he's out of range of that dude. Yes. Okay. We should be good. Okay. So this guy gets a V19 Torrent, two blues, one red, and an extra blue. 
three damage. I will go in. I'm gonna jump this V19 torrent up behind you. He's gonna attack your escort, so he gets the same. Well, let's see if you're within range one, which you are. So, okay. you will take one damage. Okay, so two hits. Um, he has swarm, so you are engaged. Okay, I got three damage. Against so three. Okay, so but your V19 or whatever it is takes a damage because okay. it didn't attack soon. If you can uh, bring it down. Okay, yeah. yeah, I just was trying to make sure. I just need to get rid of the escort now. I'm going to just take a damage before I drop a stupid butt in there. Because he's not. Well, he's, if he's engaged, with the, you might be out of range for that. Oh. No, you're in it. <laughs> okay, so. Okay, so I already took the damage pre. He's firing at your tight advance. Okay, so same thing. So two blues are red, plus one. Uh, oh, why? That's a crit. What am I great against this champ? Uh, I'm going to do. A, how much health does he have? He has. Three tight advance has three health left. I'm using swarm to re roll one. And nothing. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Okay. So that was one, two, three, four out of seven. So I'm going to activate. I'm going to activate that bomber. He has a blue and a black plus a blue because he was activated by my venator. So blue, black, and then blue. Oh, did you, did you also put the damage on it? Yeah. He just did that. Oh my gosh, okay, I'm gonna re-roll this one. Well, I can't re-roll it because he doesn't have swarm. Never mind. Doesn't do anything. Um, this is getting dumb. I'm gonna activate this guy. Taking a damage also, because your escort's just forcing that. Okay, he's gonna do the same thing. I thought I had black guys, so black guys should be doing it. There we go. Okay, so three damage. Three damage, and that will kill one. Okay, so how many did I activate? I think I activated one, four, two, five, six. Four, five, six. So, so I have one more I can activate. I'm going to activate that bomber to attack uh, the bad, dumb guy that gives me damage all the time. Okay, so I'm going to lost your scatter. And you die. So, I'll go ahead and do his counter now. Counter two. Counter two. Miss. Yes. Okay. Darn it. So, that's done. That was that guy's turn. So, you get activate. All right. Let's go ahead and activate the... Oh, uh, uh, did you move? Sorry. This yes, token. ISD has a concentrated fire. Dron does have the next uh, engineering. So, he will go ahead and do that engineering first. So, he has four engineering. So, he's going to go ahead and recharge two shields. Putting that back up to the floor. Let's go ahead and flack out the side. And then we'll go ahead and do a long range attack. So let's go ahead and do the flak attack first. So everybody within range of one of him. B19 torrent. What do you get? Okay. You get one hit. And then we'll do the next closest bomber right there. He gets two hits. Now this wide wing bomber right here in the middle. He will have two hits. You don't have to go you are rolling very Yeah, no <laughs> way. I was doing it. The Y Wing here next to the victim. He gets two hits. That's crazy. I've never rolled that good. My guy dies. And then the last uh, the Y Wing squadron here. Two hits. I was expecting you to miss at least a couple of them. Did that kill? No, we just got down to three. I just... All right. And let's go ahead and do his medium range check into... No, I'll hit your front. Yeah, I'll hit the front. Right, into the front of the pulpit. Okay. All right, here we go. So I will lock out your it's right here. It's evade, brace, or redirect. I'm going to lock out your brace. Okay. Uh, we're at medium range? 
Yes. So I'm going to force you to re-roll your double hit. One hit. That's dumb. Six. Okay. And the redirect only allows me to redirect up to one damage. Because of the XI7s. Okay, so I have a card called Addy Gala. So every token that I spend allows me to redirect up to one damage to another adjacent hole zone without being redirect. But I'm still going to spend redirect. So I have activated two tokens, so I can redirect up to one because of your card, and I can act redirect up to two because of Adagal. Okay. So and how much damage is left? Six. Six. Six damage. So I will be able to take two shields off of one side. So I'm redirecting Adagala's damage to this side. So two here. I'm doing the redirect token to this side, and then I'm taking the three on the front. Well, there we go. I'm definitely going to run over some squadrons, I believe. Yes, I run over both the squadrons here, so you got to go. Well, so he gets to decide where they go. Yeah. So, so, so you get, I, I can read, so since I'm on the base, I can read one shield or a face down damage card or something, right? Okay, so. You can do a shield. I think it's a shield. Yeah, you can do it on this side. You yeah, have two not? on that one. So we'll put it to three. There we go. Okay. That one, I'm going to activate that one. So that is number two with Adagala. She has an engineering uh, dial. So she, they have four engineering. She's going to spend her token, engineering token also, which gets her up to six engineering. And they're just going to start healing some stuff. So, <laughs> at least we know she's going to use it. One, two. So two shields. I can do up to three shields. Yeah, so I charge up the three shields on the front. That's all of her tokens and other stuff activated. Two red dice to your front arc on that ship. So, three hits. Three hits on the front of the mix? Yeah, your victory, yeah. All right. You have two shields right. and no shield, no shield. Brace that. Take it down. Take that two. Okay, two damage. I'm going to fire out my side arc into your side right here with Two, a red and a black. Side arc of your eyes. Nothing. I don't think I can re-roll anything either. Nothing. Okay, now movement. And slowly. Cute and cuddly. <laughs> okay, I'm out of your front arc. I think it's here for him. I will go ahead and activate my IS, uh, BSD. Thanks for your to navigate my command, which you actually use. I'm just going to keep it at that. He will go ahead and use, he will regenerate one because of the sweet command. I'll regenerate it on the front. And I'll spend his engineering token. Which gives you like two engineering or one? engineering, which lets me to charge another shield. So and I will put that on this side. Okay. Alright, and you, I believe, are at close range for this. Uh, maybe? If it doesn't really you matter because you, range, you so. have only blue guys. Yeah, so I'm actually going to go ahead and flack out this side. Okay. Your stuff real quick. So, I don't know if you're going to hit that one. Maybe one. You get blue. Oh, oh, Shot me in the eye. Oh, sorry. Yep, all, all of those, I think, medium range. Because you get so, one blue guys. I think it's one blue. So you hit everybody on this side except for that dude on the escort. Right, let's go ahead and do Kit Fisto. Kit Fisto. Here we go. Nothing. So, uh, this V19. Okay, nothing. Wow. The other V19. Just keep rolling blue dice. Yes. Another crit. Uh, this Y wing next to him. One hit. Dang it. Okay. Okay, what's your next hit? This one right here at the end. Okay. 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 And then that's the last one. One hit. That's what I was expecting my guys to do last time, but they did not. Alright, let's go and do his front arc. We'll be shooting into the pelter. We're gonna try and blow up the pelter. Let's see if I can kill him. Alright, so he gets the reds. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and lock out your brace and your redirect. Oh, you have to. Oh. So brace redirect. I'm going to burn my evade and make you reroll your double hit. Okay. 
Yeah. Okay. So burn that. So I did spend a token, so she can redirect up to one damage. So how much damage is left? Three. Okay, so perfect. So she redirects one to this side, and then she takes two to the front. So she had to be one. Yes, we'll get command. So I'll go ahead and turn his speed down to one. Because of hero, he can do two clicks and speed one. I don't think you're just gonna tuck this guy out of the way, and we'll put him right back in just a second. So I'm activating number three. He's doing a squadron command. So he's going to take that. He has comms net, so one to five. He's going to shoot that over to this guy. He's going to shoot this over here. Never mind. I'm going to take that as a token on the ship, and I'm going to shoot my engineering token over there. Because I already had an engineering token on that ship. Okay. So I shot the engineering token. He's going to attack. I think I can attack two people this time, actually. I can attack this guy, and I can attack this guy. Now, does that count as obstructed? No, it doesn't. I'm right behind my Venator, so I'm going to throw one red dice at your, at your Imperial Star Destroyer just to piss it off. And he gets a crit. He critically pot shot at you. Is that into the front? Yeah, that's the only thing I'm going to look at. The three? Um, he's going to fire... His two red dice into the front of this gladiator. So he's firing the two red dice. We're getting rid of your evade. Okay. And that's two damage otherwise. Yeah. I will go ahead and brace that and redirect it. So I only take one damage and I'll stick it on this shield. And then my little guy is going to move. He's still at speed one? Yeah, he's still at speed one. Alright, let's go ahead and activate the gladiator. He gets a navigate command. Well, he does have an engineering that, so he'll go ahead and use that. Well, no, he's just going to use the recharge that one shield that he took off. Let's go ahead and do some long range into the front of the Venator. So two red dice from the front. Okay. The Venator. The front of my Venator? So the front to front. Yeah, front to front. Here we go. Okay, so Chris, tip of the I'm going to salvo. And I'm going to... Oh, does he have a red to something? It's just one red dice. Uh, okay. I'm just going to chuck it at you. It's the last turn I can do it. So. I'm going to redirect. Well, I guess, yeah, it's the last one I'm going to brace off. So. Just going to cut that down to one, and I'm going to redirect. So I'm redirecting it to this side. Okay, so redirected it to that side. Then I'm going to salvo you with one red dice. Okay, to your side. Or wherever you fired from. Front. Yeah, wherever you so fired from. Yeah. Alright. Yep. Alright, let's go and do some uh, navigation. Nope, he'll stay at speed for you for now, but he's gonna take that extra. Wait, this guy can fire again after he moves. Yes. Yes, he can. I should have saved my brace. The question is whether or not he's gonna end up ramming the penalty on his effort. True that. Well, if he runs the Pelta, then the Pelta's gonna take the damage, and he guys gonna have to fire at the Pelta. Alright, so we're locked well, you in. Can try and shoot after him. So he's moving speed three? He is moving speed three. Uh, so. No, that was not a crack, I don't think. The well, shield. No, yeah, it's yeah, so, so he will go back to speed back, two. Yeah. So you both take a card. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now you get to fire again if you want to. And wait, can you fire out of the same arc? No. No. You can't fire so out of the front. You just shot you out. Oh, that's right. He shot you out of the front, didn't he? So yeah, he can't shoot you. So he can't shoot you. All right. Okay. So now squadron phase. So I have two guys here, and I have a guy there. So I have three. So they activate two, and then you'd activate uh, your one. So I'm going to activate these two guys that are behind this guy. Well, I'm going to activate one of them first. He's bombing the back of your ISD. So I'm going to hit. And I'm going to redirect that. Okay, to which side? Uh, that was it. So we're going to bring out a two, but you still suffer. Does that count as suffering damage to the rear even? Yes. Okay, so yes. yes. I get a token. Get a if you go, oh, yes, if you deal damage and you hit them in the back, it hits. It works. If it's evaded, no. If it's redirected, I'm going to fire with the other guy. Okay, so black dice again. Now I'll just have to take on the shield. 
Yeah. Have two victory tokens. Okay, they can activate your uh, interceptors. Let's shoot at this one with three. Four blues. Three damage. Yeah. Oh no, two, no, two, two, it's two, two damage. Two, two, two. He's down to one health. Okay. And you gotta activate your activator. Yep. So I'm just gonna activate him because he can't do anything. Like right now he's safe because if he activates next turn he has to hit an escort. But so that's the end of the round. So commands. Oh yeah, my redundant shields activate now. That's correct. So I'm activating my redundant shield. Inside. Okay, so everything's good. I think I got all my tokens are reset, everything like that. I got my command dials. Do you want to activate Thrawn or your, uh, your shields to maximum if you can or whatever? Is everybody concentrated on it? So is that, is, do you have your last one, right? Yeah, that is my last one that Thrawn has. Before my Pelta becomes a Thrawn, I'm going to activate Thrawn. Hmm, before my Pelta becomes a smoking garbage fire, I think I'm going to activate it. I got an engineering dial and a token. So I get six engineering. I'm just gonna start saving myself. He's surprisingly hard to kill. So I one shield there and then two shields to the front. They're actually at maximum now. Except for on that one side. Obviously, so I'm gonna fire the front arc into your side arc with two reds and a black, because we're close range. I mean we're touching. Oh, that was that was still a hit, and then that just turned into a hit. And then I will go ahead and brace. So it brings it down to two, we'll still have a crit in it. So I'll go ahead and redirect that. So I'll go ahead and take it off the front. Uh, well, I want it with and zero and zero. zero. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to fire. I might have your front arc in my arc range with this thing. For which one? I'm just going to check really quick. I don't think I do. I do not. That is close up. You would have been forward a little bit. So I'm firing on your. Yeah, your side. With a black and a red. Yeah. Black and a red. Three damage. Wow. Into the side right here. So I'll go ahead and brace that. Touch it down to two damage. And redirect it. To the front. Okay. Now I'm going to fire my Pelta to the front. Okay. Now I'll take two damage to the front. Okay. Now my Pelta kind of has to ram you. I mean, there's... I can't even turn hard enough to avoid you, so... I take two. So, yeah, he takes two. Yes! So, bam! Bounces off. Uh, I take a damage. Let's go ahead and activate the ISD. Here we go. He's got a navigation. So let's go ahead and... He's got nothing else really to do with that. Let's go ahead and flack out the back. And then he's going to... Shoot the Pelta? Can I shoot anything with the front arm? No. I do not no. think so. All right, you so flew a little fast. Side into the Pelta, flack out the back. Okay. First white wing. One. One damage. And then now... Which one? This, this guy or that guy? This one here. And then this one. Wow. Oh, he takes two. Jeez, you are nuts with your anti-flacking. I wish I had your luck when I was going against Rebecca. Okay. Well, this guy's pretty good with flacking. So let's go ahead and shoot out the side into the Pelta's side. Okay, so... Yeah, into the side. Okay, so you get three blues and red. I'm actually liking Adagawa a lot more than I thought I would. Well, you're probably going to get a lot of accuracies. Alright, so we got one. Three damage and next. So you can lock my brace or my redirect. I will lock your brace. Okay, so my redirect, the token can do one and then Adagawa does one. So three damage, so I'm redirecting two of it. I took one shield, one to the back shield and then uh, two to the side shield that he actually shot at. And you're going to use the navigator command to turn him down to speed two. Okay, so I'm gonna activate you, Lauren. Okay, so I can activate my squadrons after I move. I'm gonna shoot reds, two blues. I'm taking rid of a blue and firing. Uh, so I get a hit, hit, accuracy. I'm gonna use link turbo lasers to reroll my accuracy. 
into an accuracy. So lock down your evade. Okay, well, I'll just have to take one on the front. Two on the front. Yep. Okay, I'll just... So I think you are at close range. So I'm going to fire out the back into your front with a red, a blue, a black. Which one would you like to spend on your Venator? So I'm going to just... I'm going to spend my contain. Uh, three down. Two your front. In front of him? Mm -hmm. I'll go and spend a redirect. So zero on this side. And right there. He's moving, and then I'm going to aggregate squadrons. And I've spent his uh, squadron token. And I'm spending, I think I'm damaged somewhere. Yeah, I'm damaged on this side. So I'm going to spend the engineering token to uh, repair one shield on this side. Now I'm going to move and then activate squadrons. I move, now I'm activating my squadrons. So, everybody at long range, which should be everybody. Uh, I think we've got some. Everybody around. except for Kit Fisto, I think. Yeah, okay. I can activate those. So, just those two you can. So, I'm going to activate uh, this V19 corn squad. He's going to fire on that dude. Uh, three down. And you kill him. And I'm shooting at your back. Uh, well, it doesn't matter. I can still get tokens from it. So one damage. And I'll just have to take that on the back. <laughs> so I need another victory token. So I'm sending this other guy. I'm going to just send him right behind there. So I'm rolling. I got a damage. And I will go and redirect it. Uh, the victory still has all its tokens? He's got one. Well, he's got all of his tokens. So oh, yeah, but he doesn't have any more shields to redirect. He's got no shields. So I get another no, token. No I gotta activate this guy. Bring him up super close. Okay, so I'm firing at your rear. <laughs> okay, hit crit. Structural damage. <laughs> So I'm activating this guy, he's going to fly right up to your front, I'm going to attack, I'm going to attack your front. It's probably because you can't reach I can reach your ISD, I just want to make sure that guy doesn't get a turn. How many points does he destroy? Okay, bomber command. Okay, I'm activating this guy into your front. This guy's going to get promoted. <laughs> I feel it. No! <laughs> bomber command! <laughs> Promoted! Yes! Hey, Chris! 196 and 195. Uh, so, including uh, structural damage? Uh, no, Humnoid. I'm just, yeah. just rubbing it. You sweep by one or choose a new command tile as your top command. So, what was the other I reduced it to zero. Okay, so I'm going to activate my V19 turret. He has black dice, but he's not a bomber. So, he can do one damage, but he's not a bomber, so he has one chance of the black dice, which is Pretty high. You can do it, dude! You can do it! Boom! There goes the little V19 turret! There goes the Vic. I moved already. Those guys are activated, so it's your turn. Alright. Gladiator! You get to concentrate fire. Okay. So, Alright, let's go ahead. Might get a line of sight problem with the corner of my pelta. Maybe. Sure. Let's no, go. Nope, no line of sight. So let's go ahead and do the front arc. To my rear arc? To your rear arc. Okay. Here we go. Two reds. I'm redirecting all the damage to this side. Okay. <laughs> if I just go straight. Uh, I can tip my ship. He's going to speed three, so. Bada bing, bada boom. That is ridiculously <laughs> close. That is ridiculously close. That is some epic flying there. Now his side arc. Side arc. Into the back. <laughs> He's going to be using uh, external rex. So he gets two more black dice to his pull. So he gets four black dice base. That. Uh, and you still have concentrate fire. He does have the concentrate fire. So he will go add another black die. All right, into the rear. 
There we go. I'm bracing. <laughs> Five damage left. So I'm definitely salvoring, and I'm going to burn my redirect. I'm taking, so there's still five damage left, so I'm taking three to this side, and I'm taking two to the back. You get a token because of uh, suffering damage in my rear, and my salvo is gonna hit you right wherever you hit me with. Uh, I have link turbo lasers. I'm going to lock up your redirect. Alright. I'll go ahead and spend my evade. Burn that away. Which one are you gonna you're gonna make me? Three roll the crit. The only one that's left, yeah. Because he can't he Double can't damage! Fight. No! Nothing. Okay. Nothing. I wanted to get two reds. Two, two hits. So you can go ahead and activate your last two squadrons? No, I I got this Pelton. Oh yeah, you do. I haven't used him yet. Yeah, he has an engineering, so he's going to take that as a token, and he's going to shoot that token over to my Venator. I'm going to fire, which I have line of sight to your rear with a black and a red on the side. So black and red. Oh, Okay, two damage. And you suffer damage, so I get a token. In the rear there? Yeah. All right. I will go So he's going to take one. Take one on the back, and... Okay, so then he suffers one. No crits. Okay, I'm going to fire my front arc into your rear arc with two reds and a black. Uh, two damage. Alright, I will go ahead and burn the redirect. Okay. How many shields do you have on this side here? Zero. Zero? Okay, so I'll take them to this side here. Makes the decision easier. I am going to... Um, can't really ram him. Can you tip your, uh, tip your demolisher up a little bit? Uh, I just need to get my, or my tool out. Okay. Okay. Now squadrons. Activate running back this way. He's a little bit faster at four. He's gonna jump into here. Okay, so my redundant shield activates now. So he she's gonna gain a shield in the rear. Activate my Venator first. Alright. So the Venator, since I don't have a token on him like I should, I have a squadron command, he can only activate up to five. Okay, I'm just gonna shoot my rear arc into the side arc of your demolisher. Oh, I'm gonna spend this uh, token before I attack. Yeah, to give myself a shield in the rear. Right, so I'm firing, uh, two accuracies, link turbo lasers, two hits, and an accuracy on this guy. Uh, where is his tokens? Yeah, locking up your brains. Okay. okay, I'm going to fire out my side arc to your ISD, I believe, and I think it's your front arc. So front arc, medium range. Uh, actually, link turbo lasers. Uh, actually, actually, hit, hit. Okay, so I'm gonna walk up your brace and your uh, one of your redirects. Okay. And that's how much damage? Two damage. Two damage. So, oh, the redirect. And how many, how many shields are on that side? Zero, zero, three, one. So you have to redirect to the side. Yep. So now he's gonna move. Yes. Whatever. He's gonna hit it up refilled. Yep. That gives just enough space to see. So he does that. Okay, so two. Now I'm gonna be activating squadrons. I did I'm spending that command, so I'm actually throwing the stupid token this time like a smart person. I can activate everybody and I can only activate five. I'm going to activate my first bomber. Okay, so I'm activating this guy, jamming himself close in there. So he can hit, he can hit the side. All right, let's see what you can do. Well, he's got bomber command, so hopefully something. Yes, a hit crit. Uh, he's gonna die anyway, so. Mm. 
Okay, so I'm gonna activate this guy. This guy can move up to three. I think I'm still within range one. Yes, and we're rear arcing. Uh, bomber command. Okay. He's just gonna take it. Okay, so one, two. We're gonna activate. I don't know if he's within range. He is not. Dang it. He's barely out of range. I don't think any of my other guys are going to be able to fly fast enough. Except for maybe Kit Fisto. And I'm not trying to hit him in the back. I'm just going to try and hit him in general. No, he's not going to be able to do it. Okay. Let's see. Is he within range? Right? There's that back and then do I want to look at one more. So that was my whole chips activation. Alright. Here we go with the ISD then. Here's an engineering. So he's going to go ahead and generate uh, a fuel. Here? This way kind of gives you another one. No, that went that went down. So two there. And he'll put one on the front, one on the front. Yeah, I don't want to. All right, let's go ahead and do his long range. Yeah, I can hit him back. Yeah, you can hit me with long range. You got five red dice. Five red dice in the back of your Brace cuts it down to two. Salvo and. Uh, does it get through? Yeah, it's going to. I'm going to contain. I'm containing. So I'm spending all three of them. So Brace brings it down to two. Two damage. So it's going to go one, and then I take a, a face down card. And then I'm salvoing you at long range, so I get one red dice. One red dice on the salvo. Link for the lasers. So He's gonna flack out the side. Oh, okay, you got that guy. And then anyone in close range. So I think it's just these three. So for this guy, let's see how much damage we do. Two damage. Two damage. Yeah, that'd be great. That way, we? Uh, one damage. Okay. And then Kit Fisto. Nothing. Yes. Is he still going speed three or speed two? He's down to speed two now. I'm going to activate uh, Adi Gala. She has an engineering. I'm going to do my side arc with one shield. Uh, she's going to fire out the back into the back of the ISD. I, I got long range and I have line of sight with the rear arc. So two red dice. Uh, two damage. I'll brace it. And redirect it to the side. So I take one damage to the side. Okay, and then she might have a side arc shot to your side. Maybe. Would you like a laser? Mm. So I have I have that. I think I do. And then line of sights just through my arc to yours. As long as it doesn't cross you, it doesn't cross your arc. So I have, I think I have line of sight. I've had it. So I get one red dice. Aggro. So okay. Now she moves. At speed one. Hey, she's gonna run over some first. Now, she can. So I'm gonna definitely hit this guy. Set that person. And the shield's overlapping him. So I'm gonna do that one too. So we're gonna. Alright. Okay. Is that your last have, yeah. the last I have this one. I still have that guy. So, same thing, engineering. So, engineering, I am going to actually spend that on this ship to uh, use uh, projection experts. So, he has uh, four engineering, so he can spend up to two engineering points to spend, send two shields to another ship. So, I'm taking. Two off of the front of this, sending those two to the back of my Venator, and then I'm spending the last two to regenerate a shield on the front here. I'm using com, a comms net to fire my, my uh, squadron token over to this guy. And then firing, so I think I only have my side arc. Yep, my side arc, I get one red, two, 
I'm gonna fire at your front arc. Well, I'm gonna fire at your side arc. I think I have one of sight, so one red dice. One damage. And goes on to shield. All right. And then movement, speed one. Is he gonna hit it? It's squadron phase, well, never mind. So your squadrons can't do anything at this point. So they can they can try and fly as far as this way. But they're not going to be able to shoot. No, but the question is, is, is are we done? I think we're done. Okay, done. You're done, you're done. Okay. Okay. Did you add your scores? Yes. All right.